And welcome back to the channel. On this video, let's get by that lawnmower. On this video, I want to talk about signs and one particular sign that I came across recently. And the sign read, no motorized vehicles. And this sign was on a path that I came across or a trail and it was off of a park and so that got me thinking well do I go or don't I go and I chose not to go because I wasn't sure and maybe someone out there knows for sure the uh, laws if you want to call it that of whether you can ride an e-bike somewhere where there's a sign saying no motorized vehicles so we get to the question really what is an e-bike is it a motorized vehicle technically it has a motor but then we get the other side that legally they call this a bicycle even though it has a motor on it, it is considered by law to be a bicycle. So, um, where do you stand on that? Would you consider an e-bike as a motorized vehicle and not take it on that path? Or would you say heck I'm going on that because really I'm not a motorized vehicle even though I have a motor on my bike it's a very interesting topic uh, it didn't say anything more specific than that so I don't know if it just meant motorcycles I, I gotta think really you should be allowed to go on there because it did not say no bicycles and technically your e-bike or electric bike is a bicycle even though it has a motor on it so i'm sure lots of uh, folks out there got opinions on this one i didn't go on it um, but I'm just curious. Go ahead. I'm just curious what you out there think about that. So go ahead and leave your comment in the comments below. I wanted to go on it, not to be a speedster or, or anything. There was nobody around. I don't think there was even anybody on this path. I just wanted to explore it see where it takes me and I was just curious and uh, but I didn't do it I chose not to go on it I didn't want to get in any kind of trouble um, what would you do you come upon a sign that says no motorized vehicle do you go on it with your e-bike or do you not go on it Have you ever had that happen before? And if you have, if you've come across that before, uh, what did you do? Did you go for it or did you say, nah, I'm better not to go? I thought about it, but then I thought, you know, I mean, I don't really need to go on there. I just wanted to go on to see where where it took me and what it was all about but I didn't go maybe after I read some comments from you out there maybe you'll convince me just go ahead and do it
mean, I just want to do, I want to go somewhere where I'm actually allowed to go. And I, I kind of think you'd be allowed to, to go on that. Put it this way, if I would have been on a bicycle, a traditional bicycle, without the motor, I would have went on it. So, and technically these are considered to be bicycles. I'm sure there's things that come up from time to time and you're not sure whether it's a go or not for you. That's really the first time I've come across something that I really didn't know what to do and I just didn't do it. So there's a song back in the early 80s 1981, I believe, uh, by a group uh, band called The Clash. And they did a song that would be appropriate in this situation called Should I Stay or Should I Go? That's kind of the conundrum I had there. I, but I ended up not going, just like I say, to be... So that way I didn't break any laws or any rules or whatever. But like I say, there was nobody around that I could see, so whoop. When riding an e-bike, you always, always have to anticipate that they're gonna pull out on you. Like that lady there, elderly lady, was really close. And I uh, had my finger right here on the brake, just in case. And she was starting to go, but then she looked. I always um, side on the uh, anticipating that they're going to pull out and uh, be ready. I'm looking forward to uh, reading what you all have to say about <clears throat> the no motorized vehicle signs. Have you had that happen before? What did you do? And if you if you haven't had it happen before, what would you do if you come across that? And that's going to do it for another video here on the channel. If you like this video, hit that like button. If you'd like to subscribe to the channel, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and thank you very much for doing that. And if you want to be notified as to when the next video comes up on the channel, just hit that notification bell and you'll be notified. And if you want to leave a comment on this or any other video, go ahead and leave that in the comments below. Once again, thank you for joining me for this video. And until next time.